What's good, Nana Non Dream family? We back at it, episode 76 of the Nana Non Dream Journey. My name is Julian Talia Farrow, and you already know we coming again with another weekly business update, lessons of the week, and topic for the day, which is pick and choose. So to begin this episode, I'm going to start with the quote of this week, and it goes, the greatest enemy of communication is the illusion of communication. And I don't have the person who said this quote, I saw it or, or read it somewhere or heard it, but I think it pretty much speaks for itself and it's pretty clear. And again, the quote goes, the greatest enemy of communication is the illusion of communication. So now I can get to my business update and I wanna talk about the Saturday session this past Saturday and it was on or titled Mentor Madness. And it was where we had an opportunity for us to talk to three different mentors for around 30 minutes each and ask them any questions we had top of mind, explain the business we're building, ask for feedback, present what we're going to be showing at the showcase. And it was a, an incredible session. It was great for, for me as we went in there with questions and we were able to leave with some clarity. And I won't be able to give a recap like I typically do of the sessions because it wasn't a presentation. It was a bunch of different conversations. But I will say is what I like is that we were able to get multiple differing perspectives from the mentors we talked to from all different sides. And that left us to then make up our own mind and make our own decision on how do we want to proceed moving forward? And I think that was the best thing that, that could have happened. And ultimately, we had to make up our own mind, think critically, and then decide where we want to go. So I also want to say that showcase is one week from today. It's next Wednesday. So the countdown really does begin. And it'll be a fantastic experience for us. And again, I'm so excited personally. But it's just the beginning, right? This is just one step in, in a long journey. So with that business update out of the way, I can now get into my lesson of the week. I only have one of them for this episode. And it's more so a phrase. And it's head down, but head up at the same time. So when I say head down, I mean in the sense where we're head down with our work. We're focused. We're trying to grind. We're trying to get it. But at the same time, we can't get discouraged. We have to keep our head high, stay positive, and stay motivated. And again, the lesson is head down, but head up. So now my topic for pick and choose is going to be a real short one. This is probably going to be an overall pretty short episode. But I titled it pick and choose because that's something that you can really do when it comes to who you are. The type of person you are, that is who you are through and through. You can't pick and choose. You can't pick and choose what you go hard at, what you go easy at. It's all about your mindset. So for me, if I'm trying to go hard in entrepreneurship, if I'm trying to give my 100% in entrepreneurship, that means naturally I have to give 100% in my nine to five. I have to go hard at improving myself, giving 100%, going all out at improving myself is all connected because it's a mindset thing. If I have a mindset to slack off at my nine to five, and that means that's going to then pour into my entrepreneurship and I'm going to start slacking off there. So this topic, pick and choose, is just the fact that you can't. They all feed into one another and they all have a direct correlation. So you have to think about that before you make your decisions and and just understand that who you choose to be in one area of your life, that's going to bleed into everything else. So that's pretty much all I kind of had for, for this topic and for this episode. And again, it was a short one, but next steps for me are just continue work on the startup and really begin this countdown, seven-day countdown to showcase a day. And all right, let's get it, y'all. Going to achieve your 99 dream, and it's 99 dream because you are going to achieve your dream and it will be 100%, but nobody, nothing is perfect. So you're going to achieve 99% of that, and let's go and let's get it.